Woman orders sandwich for boyfriend, delivery man sends her this photo. They'd been together for five months, and to her, he'd been one of the reasons why her life was as incredible as it was. She hated that he now lived three hours away. Missing him, she decided to send him a special gift. What was supposed to be an act of love would send her world spiraling out of control. Adriana King was a kinesiology student living in Iowa. Already in her last year of college, the 22-year-old was working hard to ensure each part of her adult life would be perfect. Adriana had everything she'd set out to achieve. She had excellent grades at school, supportive friends and family, and a new job as a personal trainer at the local gym. But as much as her life was perfect, it felt like something crucial was missing. With everything that Adriana had achieved, she'd long felt like she needed one more thing that could make her feel complete. She'd been single for the longest while, and she wished to change this. Her pursuit of finding someone brought Mike to her door. He was the perfect boyfriend and seemingly the final piece to her happiness puzzle. But he would also be the reason her life would almost come to a halt. Adriana and Mike's relationship was something out of a romance movie. They'd shared intimate moments under sunny skies and in rainstorms. They'd carved their initials on a tree in a nearby orchard, moved in together, and even went on vacation. But every paradise has its storm, and unknown to the young couple, theirs was barreling toward them. Adriana and Mike dated for five months before everything changed. The problem was not with either of them, but rather their education. Mike was a grad student from a different college. He'd been doing his fieldwork in Adriana's city, but now needed to return to school to present his findings. His trip would start the event that put them on the global map. Mike traveled back to his college, and although he was only three hours away, Adriana felt like they lived on different continents. She would text and call him anytime she could, and Mike would answer almost every time. But as the days continued counting, the energy behind his replies seemed to reduce. What was happening? Adriana couldn't explain why her boyfriend was less enthusiastic about their relationship. Tied down by her studies, she couldn't hop into her car and drive to him. But knowing that Mike was about to defend his research before a panel of professors, Adriana didn't want to tack on more pressure. She would do just the opposite. Adriana had always been a supportive person, even when she was young. Faced with the uncertainty of her relationship, she ate back her worry and stood by Mike. The night before his big day, she decided to do something special for him. Mike's favorite food was the turkey, bacon, and provolone sandwich Jimmy Jones. Adriana called the restaurant nearest to his apartment, not knowing her actions' consequences. Adriana texted Mike to tell him about the food, asking him to tip the delivery guy when he came by. Mike didn't respond. He told Adriana he'd be going to bed early that night, so she didn't worry. It was a surprise when the delivery guy called Adriana some minutes after she placed Mike's order. She didn't know what to make of the call but picked up either way. The call would change her life. Adriana quickly answered, her mind racing about why the restaurant was calling her. Had her card declined. Couldn't the guy making the delivery find Mike's apartment? Hey the caller started. We don't usually do this, but we thought you should know that when we walked up to your boyfriend's apartment, we were able to see inside. We saw your boyfriend on the couch the delivery guy said. He was in his boxers. He took a deep breath before adding, with another woman next to him. What? Adriana asked, unsure of what she was hearing. Was this an elaborate prank from her boyfriend, something to test her trust? Or was the delivery guy making it all up to spite her? Adriana hissed out a hot breath and begged her heart to settle down. She wiped sweat she didn't know, slicked her forehead, and stood up from where she was sitting. His front door has a large window on it the delivery guy reported, seemingly realizing she'd gone quiet. We could see right through. Although he sounded genuine, could Adriana believe him? Honestly, it was so awkward the delivery guy said. I just wanted to get out of there, so I gave him the sandwich and left. Adriana thanked him and cancelled the call. The delivery guy wouldn't gain anything from the call. Yet he'd gone out of his way to tell her what he'd seen. Adriana's lips curled. She knew what she had to do. Adriana called Mike, confronting him. Of course, he refused, claiming that it wasn't him. But then he caved when she pushed further. Adriana's eyes blurred with tears, and energy leached out of her limbs. She sat down. How could he do this to her? On the verge of breaking down, she realized something she'd known all along. Adriana broke up with Mike. She'd realized she never needed him in the first place, and her life wouldn't end without him. She took to Twitter with her story, and the response was overwhelming. People commended her for her bravery, thanking Jimmy Johns for going the extra mile to show her the truth about her relationship. The restaurant also reached out, and although it didn't reveal the delivery guy's identity, it offered to cater a breakup party for Adriana.